Good morning friends. Welcome back to Panika Tutorials. I am planning to start a series called Python Programming for Beginners. Lot of my students, well wishers and subscribers who are keep on requesting me to teach Python programming from last 6 months. However, I was too busy with other courses such as C programming, data structures, operating system, computer networks, theory of computation, compiler design like that I have discussed 9 core CSC subjects and also I have discussed gate previous year questions related to these 9 different subjects and also I have discussed TCS, Wipro, Capgemini previous year questions also. So I think you would have watched my videos related to these courses. If you did not watch them, I request you to go back and watch those videos and come back to this video. In this series, I am planning to teach the Python such a way that even the 5th class student should also understand. Now you can ask me one thing, sir already several courses related to Python are available in YouTube and other social media platforms. Now what is the difference between those courses and my course? Now I will tell you, my course main objective is 5th class to 12th class students should also understand my concepts because for them the basic python will be there basic python programming will be there for them in their curriculum so now you can ask me sir what is the meaning of basic python programming so in this basic python programming i will teach them how to install the python id Okay, what is a Python, what are the features of the Python programming and what are the applications of Python, why they should learn the Python programming and then I will discuss them like data types, if conditions, okay, then loops, arrays, list, tuples and then even object oriented concepts also. All these things I will cover so that this 5th class to 12th class students also can easily learn the Python programming. Then coming to the UZ students such as BTEC, EMTech, and PhD. Now several universities have introduced the basic Python programming for even for the BTEC students also because several universities are teaching the Python programming in their first year. So this basic Python programming will also useful for the BTEC students coming to the curriculum. Now they can ask me, sir, BTEC students in third year and final year, they will work on the various, what you called various projects, the projects related to the web development, machine learning and deep learning. So even I will teach the packages such as Django, okay, and also packages related to the machine learning and deep learning such as TensorFlow, Keras, PyTorch, SciPy, NumPy, Pandas, all these things I will teach so that it will be useful for them in their projects and also in their curriculum. Now coming to the MTech and PhD students, several MTech students and PhD students are already working in the field called machine learning and deep learning. So they are doing the research on these fields, machine learning and deep learning because these Machine learning and deep learning can be used in various applications such as medical image processing you can use. Okay. And then even you can use it for such as NLP natural language processing, speech recognition, all these research domains you can use the machine learning and deep learning concepts. Even you know that machine learning and deep learning models can be easily implemented with the help of Python libraries such as TensorFlow, okay, and then we have the Keras, we have the PyTorch and Scikit-learn. So using those libraries, you can implement or design the models related to the machine learning and deep learning for the particular domain. So my playlist will be designed for them also. So I will teach the all the libraries or even you can say that packages such as I will teach the NumPy 
ओके ईवन बेसिक पैथन प्रोग्रामिंग ई विच दिल टीच द नंपै अंड विल टीच द पांडा ओके दिल टीच द सैकिट लर्न and i will teach the matplotlib okay then i will teach the keras and then tensor flow and even i will teach the pytorch because now pytorch we it is very useful for the designing deep learning models okay tensor flow you can use it for the deep learning and also for the machine learning so these are the things i will teach in this playlist so i request everyone to watch the entire playlist in a sequence so that you will understand the concepts and i am very sure that in less than 1 year i will complete this entire python programming i can give you the guarantee you can remember the date also today date is i think it is 16 august 2021 so i am very sure that in one year so 16 august 2022 i will complete all these packages okay i will give you guarantee and the entire course will be provided for the free of cost so what you have to do is that you should watch one or two videos if you feel they are worthy please subscribe to my channel share the videos with your friends if you does not like the concept please share the videos with your enemies so this is about python programming we'll start the basic python programming from the next video thank you so much for watching the complete video